and the last fort's resting in the lake bed. So that's the one with the bow. At least your accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mum's. Last one back to the car buys dinner. I brought MREs. You're no fun. this time. You handed yourself on. All things considered. What things are those? No real combat training. Ah. Slightly <laughs> impulsive. Run around the field like a maniac. Need to learn what short control first means. All right. <laughs> Jungle combat tonight. I'm in serious. Just the one in the lake bed left. So close. Once more, with Gusto. Here we go. Hey, I'll take care of this one. Okay. Starting to think the boss was all talk. I know. Hey, who's there? It's oh. Fraser! Hey, hey, move! That's it. We're clear. Probably a to the others. Can't be helped. Come on. Boys really don't want me shooting from down here. I'm coming for you. Okay, we're all clear. Won't be the last of them. That was a big truck parked up front. We'll keep our eyes open. We'd better. We'd walk right up the cliff. You do have a sense of humor. Would have preferred a head start over the spot. Not much we can do. Besides, doesn't matter who starts, only who finishes. Follow me!
Dean. More friends up ahead. They don't know we're here. Good. Right side, right side. All things considered. What the? Guy down over here. Like a dinner. I've got you. Alright. Are we clear? Good. Good to be clear. Just what I was gonna say. Some kind of mechanism. Here we go. <laughs> Perfect. That should do it. Definitely. Figured you'd want to take the easy way over. Oh, please. Show me how it's done. Watch and learn. Beg your pardon? Doing all right? I'm fine. Just don't get started without me. Sure. Wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> there you are. Having fun. Just like the monkey bars in primary school. I'd say this is safer than the playground at my school. Uh, nearly there. Uh, made it. I'm impressed. You're impressed. I'm tired. Let's get this done. So, this will be a bow. Oh, what the hell? That's not fair. Sharama. Come on, let's get this over and done with. Yep. Oh, shit. See? I told you it was dangerous. You hurt. Just my dignity. Here we go. There'd be water. Now that's three. You know, you're pretty good at this whole treasure hunting thing. I'm a quick study. Mm. One question, though. I reckon that you could pretty much do anything you want. Why are you so keen to get Shoreline back? Seriously? My partner turns my own men against me. My lieutenant makes off with a bounty. Nathan and Samuel Drake get off scot-free and you're asking why I want Shoreline back. Yeah. I was on my watch. I lost it on my watch. What the hell is that thing you keep playing with? 
It's my stress toy. It showed up in the mail a few weeks after we got to Australia. All right, we better get a move on. We don't want Asav to get ahead of us. You know, I've had my fair share of screw-ups. <laughs> you just pick yourself up and move on. I don't like to fail. No one does, love. Let's find a way to get back down to the car. Sounds good. Ah, <clears throat> oh, this is open now. anywhere else out there. Now's the time to do it. Right. Here we go. Coming. Right behind you. suppose it takes to carve something like this? Years. Decades, even. The Hoi Sala certainly did have a knack for stonework. And the war, it seems. That too. They must have made these to commemorate their victories against the Persians. Looks like they put up a good fight. They did. Pity it didn't last. Their loss is our gain, right? That carving looks familiar. That carving is an exact match for the disc. So what does that mean? I don't know yet. But I'm guessing we should give that a try. Should we dance? Try not to break it this time. Sassy. What the hell? Well, that's what I'm talking about. Can't say I was expecting that. You ready? Yeah. Just, um, taking it all in. Welcome to downtown Halabadu. The last known resting place, the task of Ganesh. Spectacular. <sighs> hmm. And what? Doesn't it look like there's a dam or something between the two Ganesh statues? Must have been eroded by the falls. So how do we get in? Hang on. Yeah. Look at the crown. It's not wear and tear. You're right. Maybe it was a watchtower. Bet that's how the Persians got in. I have heard about this place for so long. <laughs> I can't believe I'm actually looking at it. You should take a picture. Send it to your dad. <laughs> Great idea. What? You're one of those cultures who can't work a computer? Just take the picture. Show it to him in person then. No, it's uh, just a few decades too late for that.
Look, I'm... Oh. Oh, God, please, no. It's fine. <laughs> Shall we, uh, head over to Halibadoo? Still stands, but they're gone. Maybe their king should have used their wealth to protect his people and not make such an inviting target. Farmer stairs dull. Oh. What's left of them, anyway? Any thoughts how we get up to the crown? Did you bring the helicopter? I left it at home. Bum. Then I guess we're close. Okay. Ready? Look for a way up. There, look. You can see some structures beneath the falls. Give me that. It'll save us both some time if you just assume it's not. Oh, it's oh. Oh. oh, boy. It's definitely not safe, by the way. I saw. Think you can get back up here? Yeah. Keep going. I'll catch up. Yeah. I've got you. All right. I can manage. Come on up. But only because you said, please. I didn't, actually. Once you said Ganesh was the removal of obstacles. He's more than happy to place them in your way if he thinks you'll benefit. That why the horse and I chose him for Hanabadu? He's also the lord of good fortune, the one you pray to for prosperity and success. Got it. That's cool. Really, the only way across. Yep. Amazing. Fun, right? You're doing great, China. Yes. What we're doing better when we get the car. Surprised we haven't seen the Sav yet. Knock on wood. Oh, he's around. Doc will see him up here. Why is that? He doesn't have the stones to climb this high. <laughs> I think I see a place we could swing over to the crown. Huh? Oh, 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 thank you. Hurry up and climb. I'm slipping.
Worth it? Impressive. Yeah. Now, how do we get off this thing? Okay. Easy does it. Feels more sturdy up here. Don't jinx us. It's our way in, courtesy of the Persian army. Wow, nice shot. Persians must have had a trebuchet. Incredible. It's our old friends, Harasharama and Ganesh. Friends? Looks like they're fun. Well, when the Hindu gods aren't off fighting demons, they're sometimes fighting each other. But it's not a fair fight. I guess it's not really his style. <laughs> Through here. Right hey, look, our moments. You were right, Nadine. I have my moments. This old Persian. Now we're getting somewhere. Hey, another one of these doors. Now let's see. Oh, good. This one actually works. Nice to get some light. Hey, up here. What the hell? Jesus. This was it. Their final stand. Oh, wasn't enough to save their empire. But their loss is our gain. Here's our way in. Nadine, can you lend a hand with this chap? Sure. Come on, old fellow. Here we go. Excuse me. <laughs> Sorry. We must be getting close. Hopefully closer than these guys. This device looks familiar. Oh. Well, that's different. What is all this? If I had a guess, I'd say it's some kind of lock mechanism to open that door. Okay, on the left, we have Shiva gifting Parashurama the axe. And on the right, we have Parashurama chopping off Ganesha's tusk. Wait. With the axe? Yeah. The one that Shiva, Ganesha's father, gave to Parashurama? Yeah. Hush. <laughs> it's messed up. That's family. Come on, let's see about opening that door. So how does all this work? Uh, only one way to find out. Let's see what this does. Right, that slid the piece away from me. It's Let's try this. Over you go. I see what. The shadows match the moon. Right. So let's see. All up. It really looks like fun.
Okay. What next? I think that's it. You did it. Doors open. All in a day's work. Salah and the tiger. Here we go. Fingers crossed. That's supposed to happen? I don't know. Just don't get us killed. You're no fun. Ready? Oh. Careful. Hmm. Amazing. What the Shiva? Mm, my thoughts exactly. Razor? Ross? Oh no. No, it's okay. I think we're gonna be okay. Okay? Where the hell's the tusk? I don't know. None of this makes any sense. Yeah, it does. The Hoysala sent us on a fool's errand. I think you're right. Terrific. No, hear me out. Ganesh is the symbol of... Halabadu. And Shiva was the symbol of... Belor. Which was the old... The old capital. Exactly. What if the king built this spectacular city, and it was a wonderful target for the Persians? And the old capital was forgotten. So this whole city was a decoy. What if they let it get plundered to protect Balor? And their treasure. I'm willing to bet the tusk was never here at all. So where's Balor? This is definitely not supposed to happen. It's coming loose! Uh, Grab the edge, quick! Razor! Uh, 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 I'm okay! Go! A huge waterfall here? There was. What the hell is that? Aqueduct. <laughs> the water's channeling there from the falls. Amazing. Did we do this just now? Well, technically I did. Cocky. Look, uh, sorry if I cut too close to the bone back there.